Wow, just that was just weird. Yeah, yeah, that was weird, kind of. Oh, didn't should we the blower? We didn't tell them the story of how Fred, how Fred gets like his anger side. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. You had to bring that up, didn't you? Oh, darling, we all have it. It's not just you. Yeah, but he has the most dipness one, like kill flip. Wait, what? Uh, all right, all right. You, you, you tell her. All right, all right. So I just, I, ever since I left Fred's dad, I met a guy named Mike. Apparently, after I got Fred in the house, he wasn't really c fond of Fred. What do you mean not fond of him? Like he didn't like me. He thought I was just like my dad, because I just, I looked just like him. That doesn't make any sense. That's yeah. That's what I yeah. That's yeah. That's what I said. All right, Matt. On all right. What, what was the rest? Anyways, yeah. Basically, one night he got mad. He yelled at me because basically he didn't want Fred around the house. I told him he's my son and I do as I please. So then he scratches me across the face with a knife. He cut you actually. Yeah, and then Fred comes in here, comes in the living room, and says, Mike hurt Ballora. I said, Michael, you hurt Ballora. And Mike flipped out at him, told him to go back to his room. But Fred wouldn't move, because he was, cause I was hurt. So I went off to go get something to patch it up. And I, what did he say to you when I left? Oh, he said, what you looking at, little brat? And I, I don't really much remember what happened. I do. Basically, I hear Fred screaming and like yelling. And I said, I swear to God, if you're hurting my son, I'm gonna fucking kill you. And I come in and I see Fred, Fred uh, on top of him choking him. And I, and I scream his name. I pull him off and I put it as Mike ran out the door. I pulled, I was I carried Fred to his room and put him on the bed. I was like, why would you do that? And you said? I said he was hurting you. He was making you unhappy. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, that Mike, yeah Mike was a douche. Yes. Yes, he was. After that, he, he tried to sue us, but didn't work. Because, one, he put his hand on me. And he kept calling, he called Fred a psychopath. He said he was a psycho. He needs to be going into an asylum. That's actually another story. Wait, what? Yeah, I, I, yeah, I was put in Ravenhurst Asylum for the very first time. Wait, I thought it was that other time. No, no, it wasn't. You got put in there for like freaking, cause something happened with your code? Yeah, basically. I, I, let's not talk about that, okay. Yeah, yeah, he was sent to Ravenhurst Asylum before, but we'll tell him, we'll talk, that's another story for later. So basically, yeah, Fred almost got put into the asylum again until like, they found out that it was him, that it was Michael that hurt me first. Wait, hold on, why did you get to put in the asylum the first time? Purple man makes me go insane. That's all I'm saying. We can tell that story later. All right. Yeah, legit, he was such a douche. Yeah, we all know that. We all know that Michael was a douche. No, he's not a douche, he was a dick. Fred. Sorry. Wait, did, what's, didn't, some, didn't Mike put his hands on Fred one time? Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Oh, my God. This, this fucking creep put his hands on me because I was freaking, like, I was mind my, I accidentally dropped the cup on the ground. And it, it didn't break. It spilled. I was, I was, I said sorry, and then he grabs me by my throat and then throws me in my room. And then I came, and I come to check on him, and I hear Fred crying. I'm like, what the fuck did you do now? I go up to him, and I'm like, what the fuck did you do now? He's like, and then he said, he spilled a cup. So I punished him. And I go to Fred, and, and I tell him to calm down, stop crying. And I tell him what he, and I, I told him, what did he do? And Fred said that he grabbed him by his neck and threw him in the room. And we all know that Fred was telling the truth because Fred never, Fred won't lie to us. He doesn't want us to be angry with him. Yeah, I was telling the truth. And yeah, I know you would, Audie. Yeah, 
Yeah, so basically he was supposed he was he was gonna be Fred's stepdad, but it didn't work out well, so that's why I don't go out with guys anymore. All I need is Matt Hunt and my little Fred Bear. Oh, oh god. Especially when I left you guys, I broke. But when I met Torley, I felt a little better. Yeah, you did. Anyways. I have a little video clip of that, so here, here, here it is. But you won't be able to see it until the until that part of Fred's Pass comes out, which should be which part two should coming out really soon. So be ready for Freddy or for Fredbear or Escape Fred doesn't matter. See you guys next time. Bye.